My name is Ed Schirmhorn. I'd like to do a brief demonstration for you of WebEx calling in the Microsoft Teams environment. We're going to show how you disable the calling in the Microsoft Teams environment and how those Cisco tools are now available for every chat. Show a little bit about the cross-launching of the WebEx Teams application to actually facilitate the call. We'll show manual dialing, some mid-call handling experiences within the experience, how to set up some speed dials, and even how you can leverage desk phone control. If you notice here in the highlighted area, the Microsoft Teams calling features have been disabled at the organizational level. Now our user is going to place a call by selecting the icon on the bottom and then clicking the call prompt that comes up. The call is now established. As we can in any other time, we have mid-call handling features that are available. So let's first start by placing the call on hold and then we can resume the call as well. Next, let's conference in someone else. Brings up the dial pad and we can enter this person's extension or we could have typed the name as well. And we click call. The first call is, is uh, conferenced and then we merge the calls together to bring in a unified work stream. And then of course we can end the call. Coming back to the chat window, we can select the call icon again from the tray at the bottom. Place the call, and this time, instead of conferencing, let's actually transfer the call. So we'll select and we'll transfer, dial the person's extension again, just like we have in the past. And this is going to enable us to do a consultative transfer. So we've talked to the person, and now we're going to complete the transfer. In addition to selecting a call from a chat, we can also manually dial calls. So we can select the WebEx calling tab from the side, brings up our dial pad, and we can dial the digits as we would uh, on a regular telephone. And place call. In addition, in the Microsoft Teams environment, we have the ability to enter speed dials. So here's one that I've already created. We see the speed dial there. We can just press the call icon and dial the number. It brings up the calling window just like we've seen in the past. However, additionally, we can create new speed dials. We'll show how this is done. Simply search for a person's by name in your corporate directory, and you can add them. In addition, you can also add, say, a user, maybe your organization has still UCM connected to it, and we can select users from that group as well and add a speed dial for those users. Because we're leveraging all the features of the WebEx calling environment, we do have the ability to even see voicemail. We open up the WebEx Teams client, and we here we see the visual voicemail. We can select it. We can play it. We can also choose to delete it or even mark something as unread. Now we show desk phone control by pairing the desk phone with the WebEx Teams client. Select a device and pair with it. With desk phone control, I can place the call as the phone goes off hook I'll answer the other end we st still have all the same mid call handling and I'm able to end the call from here thank you very much for your attention during this brief video demonstration